So today I'm in Quarrington and I'm here with Marcus and Jessica from Total Electrical Services and we're fitting this, the Lumo from CPN Cudis. So Jess, have you fitted one of these boards by CPN Cudis yet? No. Jess, you're part of a husband and wife team, so what's it like working with Marcus? It's all right, it's very fun when I'm right. Got to have a bit of give and take and uh, the boss at work and I'm the boss at home, so it works out good for me. Are you okay? Mm -hmm. Well, I'm very excited to be here. And that is mainly because we are fitting the Lumo from CPO and Cudis, and for a very good reason. This property had solar panels installed during the mad rush back in 2011. And like many installs put in back then, it was a case of throw it in, whack it on a 16 amp MCB and move on to the next install. But this technology was in its infancy back then and many electricians didn't know the impact that DC leakage can have on an AC circuit. And now with more and more appliances, USB sockets, central heating pumps and EV chargers, the amount of DC feeding back into the installation causes the toroid of the RCD to, well, turn into a magnet and not work. But we just didn't know back then and regulations and manufacturers just couldn't keep up with the demand. Fast forward to today, and not only do we know the issues posed by DC currents, but also the issues around energy flowing the other way. And so CPN and Cudis have launched their bi-directional RCBOs into the market. And Marcus and Jessica from Total Electrical Services are fitting them at this property today. This install looks straightforward enough. However, Marcus is not taking any chances and is testing the installation first, which does seem sensible. And it's nice that I get to be Marcus's assistant for today. It's all okay, it's time to rip out the old and in with the new. Two knockouts on the back made way easily enough. However, as this was coming through the cavity, Marcus opened up the knockouts for a better entry. CPU and Cudis do provide grommet strips in their accessories pack, but Marcus seems to be a fan of this grey one. Board mounted and circuits wired in, it was a quick and painless install with this Lumo board. And it's available in many module sizes and comes with SPD Type 2 protection. And I love the light in the lid. I don't know why, I just think it's cool. So this board seems to have gone in a dream and we're just onto the light testing now. It's a nice compact board and it seemed to have enough space in the back to dress the existing cables. But what sets this board apart is those bi-directional RCBOs. A huge thanks to Marcus and Jessica for smashing out this install today. And be sure to check out CPN Cudis' website for their full range of bi-directional RCBOs and consumer units. From me, it's bye-bye for now.